Let's take a look at this wooden toy gun I got from Timu. It has P320 etched on the side and it appears to be modeled after the Sig Sawyer P320. It says rubber bands fire wooden guns in bursts. In the packaging we have an instruction manual, a bag of rubber bands and a file and three wooden boards. Let's take it out of the plastic wrap. Here's another instruction manual. Looks like it's the same one as the one I took out earlier. Here are the three wooden board puzzle pieces. The full assembly procedure will be at the end of the video. Here's the assembled product. It's a bunch of wooden boards sandwiched together and with a rubber band gripping two of the pieces, it creates the trigger mechanism. Actually, it's pretty neat. To load it up, the rubber bands use as ammo loops around the front sights and then to the rear where the hammer would be. It can hold a maximum of five rubber bands. As you pull the trigger, it shoots off the topmost rubber band and every rubber band below it moves up one notch. That's a pretty neat idea. Let's see it in action. Here's a side view. Here's the first person perspective view. It was surprisingly powerful as even from 10 feet away it was hitting the target with some force. Here's the assembly video sped up 4x. I had some trouble fitting the pegs into the holes near the end. If I had to do it again, I would file down the pegs with the small included file. Match the size of the peg to the number assigned to it on the instructions. There's only three sizes. I broke some of the pegs but luckily they included more pegs than was needed for the full assembly. 